Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is the 45th tutorial in this course and in this tutorial we'll talk about how we can pass arguments to subroutines in Perl. So as you can see I have a script opened up here it's called arguments and in this script on line number 3 I have used a sub keyword to create a subroutine called rectangle and then uh, the code in the subroutine uh, I mean the the body of the subroutine starts at line number 4 where I have the opening curly brace and it ends at line number 9 where I have uh, the closing curly brace for the subroutine and then on line number 10 I have made a call to it. Uh, the name is rectangle and this time uh, as you must have noticed I have uh, passed two numeric arguments to the subroutine. So arguments are values with which this subroutine is going to work. So what we're going to try to do is we are going to try to compute the area and perimeter of a rectangle uh, you know given the fact that we know its length and its width so the length and width are going to be inputs to uh, this rectangle subroutine and uh, given those inputs it's going to compute for us the area and the perimeter so on line number five I have uh, you know calculated the area and I have stored it in a variable called area and this is a scalar variable of course that's why th there's a dollar sign here and in Perl the way you access subroutines is uh, you know you have to use the add the rate symbol then you have to put an underscore and for accessing the first argument passed you need to fetch the value at index 0 so you know obviously since we have the add the rate symbol here you must have figured that the values are passed in uh, a list and uh, the first item in that list is the first argument passed so in this case uh, this would be 10 and then the item at index 1 would be the second item passed so you know that in this case would be 20 so you calculate the area by multiplying the length and width that's why I have the asterisk in between uh, the two arguments and then uh, you calculate the perimeter as uh, uh, twice of the sum of length and width so you have to add uh, the two arguments first and then you have to multiply the result with two to get the perimeter on line number seven I have a print statement that is first going to display the text area of the of the rectangle is and then it's going to display the area and then the unit which would be square units and uh, on line number eight I have a print statement that's going to first display the text perimeter of the rectangle is and then it's going to display the uh, perimeter value and uh, then it's going to just display the text units so in Perl the peculiar thing about uh, passing arguments to subroutines is that you do not have to mention in uh, the function declaration uh, whether the function is going to receive arguments or not so over here I haven't put a set of parentheses that's going to inform Perl about the fact that this subroutine is going to eventually accept arguments when, when you call the uh, subroutine with arguments uh, Perl automatically realizes that you are going to you you are trying to pass arguments to the subroutine and you know you can access those uh, subroutines in the manner uh, thus uh, shown so I'll make sure that the script is saved and I'll press F5 to run and we see that the area of the rectangle is 200 square units and the perimeter of the rectangle is 60 units so that's uh, correct those are correct values and I hope you guys had fun watching this video you may subscribe to my channel if you haven't already I'm gonna see you in the next tutorial till then take care